discovers that scrolls walk among us, but makes the mistake of confiding in fellow scientist Henry Pym, himself a scroll agent, with the counterfeit Pym having incapacitated the Fantastic Four's leader. Scroll warships make planet fall, ready to conquer Earth in the name of their alien god. A scroll disguised as the invisible woman of the Fantastic Four targets the team's home, the Baxter Building. The plan, open a portal that will draw their headquarters into the negative zone, disposing of them in one fell swoop. Peak, the first line of defense against alien invasion. But that will do little good when a scroll disguised as Agent Dum Dum Dugan is already there to sabotage them. Arvis, the Avengers butler, is a scroll who introduces a computer virus that incapacitates the headquarters of S.H.I.E.L.D., leaving it vulnerable. In the rugged savage land, Earth's heroes discover a fallen spaceship containing earlier versions of themselves, claiming to be the genuine articles. Confusion and war ensue. As helpless citizens look on, the scrolls pour through the streets. They claim to have come to bring peace in the name of their god, but in short order they are slaughtering innocent civilians. As people flee, the only hope Earth has rests with their mightiest heroes. The scrolls believe their conquest of New York City is complete, but are unprepared for Nick Fury's reinforcements. The battle is now truly joined. The interdimensional battle rages in the Baxter building. Safeguards attempt to shut down the widening portal, but the disguised scroll agent overrides them, allowing the portal to build in strength. The thing discovers her treachery, but too late. Enemies are at the gates. Abigail Brand single-handedly invades a scroll ship and rescues Reed Richards, who holds the secret to defeating the Skrulls. She now has to return him to Earth while the heroes, in constant communication with her, distract the Skrulls by continuing a relentless defense of the peak. Even as the Skrull invasion continues on land, Maria Hill and the forces of S.H.I.E.L.D. continue their battle to keep the Helicarrier airborne hoping against hope that Earth's heroes will be able to turn the proverbial tide before the Helicarrier crashes into the ocean, becoming victim to literal tides. Skrull Queen Varen 